Hello, Ed here. I'm going to talk to you a little bit more about the Ancher electric bikes. And just e-bikes in general. You know, good reasons to have an e-bike. One, you don't have to have any license on them. You don't have to have any insurance on them. They don't take any gas. You charge it up. And uh, basically, that's a lot of good reasons right there. You know, for once, the government's not making money off something we're driving. I can drive that thing all week long. I can look at everything I want to look at. I go shopping on the thing. Doesn't cost me a dime, you know, or very little to recharge it. Uh, I've got the Ancher electric bike. It's a really inexpensive electric bike, and I've got an electric tricycle that I built. The electric tricycle probably, oh, I don't know, about the same price as the electric bike because I built it. It's got a motorized front wheel on it. You've seen it in my other video. But, I mean, really... I take the electric bike to work all the time. I work two miles from here. I can ride that thing to work. I can lock it up. Uh, I think it's fantastic. I can do all my errands in town on it, go to the post office, drive around. Think about all the money you spend in gas on on your car, or your truck, or whatever you're driving out there. There's no reason to further the uh, gas company's pocketbook there or the the government there, uh, you know, and you can spend a lot of money on an e-bike, and I've talked about this before, but uh, if you're just basically starting out, I'd go for something on the inexpensive side. Now, I bought the Ancher electric bike for the primary reason that I don't have to pedal thing if I don't want to. I can ride that like a motorcycle. It's got a twist grip throttle. I ride that thing all over town. It doesn't bother me at all. If I want to pedal, I can. It's got pedal assist on it. It'll uh, double the battery life if I use the pedal assist. I mean, really, I drive right by the gas station. I live every second of that. I got a 99 Tahoe. It gets about 18 miles to the gallon on a good day. I love driving it, but I like my electric bike a whole lot better. Uh, when the Tahoe broke in, I was stuck driving the electric bike because that's all I had to drive. And I got to tell you, that wasn't a bad experience. So, uh, think really hard, you know. I, I got bicycles, and I love riding regular bicycles. But I'm 55 years old and my knees are horrible shape. So I'm just saying, you know, don't let your health get in the way of your enjoying your bicycle. If you like to bicycle, go for it, man. E-bike's the only way. Now, it's true I've had motorcycles all my life. I got a MS there, and uh, a few bad things with the MS is uh, the balance factor. I got vertigo. I had to get rid of the motorcycles. But I drove motorcycles for ever since I was 16 years old. I do miss the motorcycles, but the vertigo doesn't bother the bicycle situation at all. And in those days when um, I just can't do the bicycle thing, I use the tricycle. It's kind of like the old people's version of a getting around there, but it works. It's a Swin three-wheeler. I bought the electric front end on it, and it came with the controller. And that was $159 off of eBay. Then I hunted around, and I found the... Uh, battery pack for it through AliExpress, and that was like uh, $285. And it came with the charger, and uh, it took less than an hour to put that together. And uh, I love driving that thing. It's fast. That'll do 27 to 30 mile an hour. That's pretty fast on a three-wheeler. The Antro electric bike will do 17 mile an hour. Now, if you put that electric front wheel or electric rear wheel on a... Uh, regular mountain bike or something like that, you'd fly. Um, the front wheel kit that I bought was 48 volt. And uh, it's got a 1,000 watt motor. The entry electric bike's got a 250 watt motor and a 36 volt battery. And the range is basically the same. Uh, you can actually get a 48 volt battery and put on the answer. It's kind of... Redo things a little bit there, and it'll double your, double or triple your uh, range there, and make it go a little faster. Anyway, hey, give it a thought. Uh, this is Ed, and I'm out. Have a great day.